All right, hello, welcome back everybody. PayPal and Patreon are down below if you want to support me, only do so if you actually can. This time we will be going down the list from highest to lowest electricity consumption levels for each individual country. And this is as of the latest data released in the Statistical Review of World Energy a couple months ago. So the world as a whole at the moment has reached a level of averaging about 3.4 terawatts of demand load across the global grid, across all grids in all countries and regions combined. And again, that and each of these other numbers is the general average. It obviously fluctuates in each country and region based on time of day, season of the year, whether it's a weekday or the weekend. But for general averages, while the U.S. is the largest oil consumer, China is the largest electricity consumer with their average demand load on their grid now averaging 1.1 terawatts themselves for a single nation. So they roughly constitute one third of the global electricity demand total. The U.S. is the second highest individual country electricity consumption wise and continues to average about 500 gigawatts of demand load. Third place is India, who is now up to an average electricity demand load of about 200 gigawatts across their grid, and they are rapidly increasing by around 10% each year. Russia comes in at number four, averaging about 130 gigawatts, and they're relatively stable in that area. They've been around there since their economic recovery post-90s. Japan has gradually decreased over time, they were once up at about 130 themselves a few decades back, but have gradually dropped down to now averaging around 110 in the 2020s. Brazil and Germany are both up at 80 on average. Canada is up at an average of about 70. France averages around 60 gigawatts. South Korea also averages around 60 gigawatts of demand load. Saudi Arabia is now up to averaging 50 gigawatts of demand load, while across the Persian Gulf, Iran averages about 40. And they're going to be stopping here because of the internal turmoil and gradual breakdown of things in the country. Meanwhile, three other countries are up to an average demand load of about 40 gigawatts on their grid now, those other ones being Turkey, Indonesia, and Mexico. Four countries have an average electricity demand load of about 35 gigawatts on their grid, those being the UK, Italy, Spain, and Vietnam. Australia has an average of about 30, or a bit below it, and Taiwan also averages around 30. Egypt now is up to averaging about 25 in present day, South Africa is now down to averaging around 25 or even 24. Their actual demand load would be closer up to 30 or a bit above 30. However, their power grid cannot actually provide that much electricity, which is part of the reason why the country constantly has, you know, those off and on massive power cuts for entire regions for many hours of each day. The whole reason behind that and the degradation of their power grid you can see in the video linked up in the corner there. Following them, we have another set of four countries who have around 20 gigawatts of demand load. Poland is one, Thailand is the next, along with Malaysia and the UAE. Then dropping down to the next rounded level of around 15, we have a long list. So get ready. Sweden. Norway, Argentina, Pakistan, Iraq, Kazakhstan, the Philippines, and the Netherlands. Then, those that round down to 10 gigawatts of average demand load are comprise an even longer list. Ukraine, Bangladesh, Belgium, Venezuela, Chile, Colombia, the Czech Republic, Finland, Uzbekistan, Kuwait, Israel, and Algeria. Then going below 10 gigawatts of average demand load into very low demand countries, we have two countries that average 8 gigawatts of demand load, those being Switzerland and Austria, three countries that average 7 in present day, those being Peru, Romania, and Singapore, Greece averages about 6 gigawatts of demand load, 
along with Portugal and Qatar, Oman, Hungary, and New Zealand all average about 5. Then a long list of countries average about 4 gigawatts. Ecuador, Nigeria, Bulgaria, Ireland, Slovakia, Belarus, Azerbaijan, Bahrain, Denmark, and Serbia. Five countries average around three in present day, those being Libya, Jordan, Iceland, Ghana, and the Dominican Republic. And for the final level, though some countries average less than two, so this isn't even my final form, but the final level that we will actually say in the video, those that average two gigawatts, those that round down to or up to two gigawatts, is the longest list yet. And that comprises Angola, Bosnia, Myanmar, Croatia, Costa Rica, Ethiopia, Sakadvelo, which everybody calls Georgia, Guatemala, Kyrgyzstan, Lithuania, Mozambique, North Korea, supposedly, Panama, Paraguay, Slovenia, Sri Lanka, Syria, Tajikistan, Turkmenistan, Uruguay, and Zambia. And that is the lowest in numbers we will be going. So thank you everybody for sticking around and listening. Like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already. PayPal and Patreon are down there if you want to support me, only do so if you actually can. There's also a link to a Google Drive folder with docs containing all kinds of different graphs, charts, data compilations across all kinds of different topics and subjects. A link to my Catch channel will be in the top pinned comment as well. May God bless and protect you all, and I will see you all around next time.